Hi everyone, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you may be. Thank you very much for joining me. What a pretty picture of the Upper Geyser Basin. Look at the shadow here in the back of the valley. Yeah, different geysers going off. I'm Mary with Mary Greeley News. Thank you very much for joining me today. It had been a few earthquakes. It was dirty earlier. You can see the gases coming up. Um, maybe this one here looks a little blue for that one. And as it dissipates on this one, it's showing a little blue. And yeah, see how blue that one is? Yeah, different gases. USGS is reporting nine earthquakes today, the largest being a magnitude 2.4 by Stanley, Idaho, uh, along the Snake River Plateau, and more recently a 0 0.4. That was 8.2 miles. Uh, well, we can't count this one, can we? It's a quarry blast, which was up there towards the top. Okay, we got a 2.3, 5.5 miles, um, Idaho, Montana border. What? I'm talking about confusing. Let's zoom into that. That's Hedgen Lake. Oh, we got two of them there. Uh, let's see, what's this other one? A 0 0.4. Let's bring this back out. Okay, bring it out a little bit farther. All right, a little bit farther. Some of them disappeared there. Okay, 2.4 was the largest, and then the 2.3. That was both by Stanley, Idaho. So I downloaded three different monitors. Here we got Holmes Hill, which is near Hedgen Lake. We got West Thumb. I seen some screaming there on that one. And then Maple Creek. Yeah, a lot of, a lot of little ones in red. Let me go to West Thumb first. Yeah, let me bring this down. Right there was the first indication of screaming. Yeah. Okay, let's go to the spectrogram. Yep, look at the heat that came up. Yep, heat and lots of gases. Mostly heat. Yeah. West Thumb. Okay. And we got some more here. And another one there. Looks like another one right there. Okay. This is probably the most recent screaming that I saw. What I did notice earlier for one of these quakes, the popping, I talked about how the ground's getting really brittle. Let me pull this over. So it doesn't bend as the pressure from the magma comes in. Yeah, this is what it was showing when I pulled the files a little while ago. It's currently 6 o'clock um, Central Daylight Time, which would make it 5 o'clock, 5 p.m. there at the park. Okay. And... Okay, so this would have been um, the last of what I pulled. About 5.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time, so that would have been 4.30. The most recent largest earthquake other than the screaming I did want to show you some other stuff was that one at 1357 Universal that would have been at 757 there at the park a.m. that rattled for quite a while it comes in as a magnitude 1.80 let me bring it back up I wonder if it's going to go small on me see the seismic signature how it rattled on yeah, it actually went longer than what I uh, pulled from. Yeah. Okay. This is a mixture between fault movement and volcanic tremors. Yeah. Interesting signature. Can't really say these are earthquakes. This is just popping of the ground for these right here. What else do we have here? Let's bring it up. Okay. Oops, trying to pull this over. Let me close this again. Mm, okay, 
Now this would have been yesterday. Let me pull this over. Um, yeah, a lot of magma coming up. Yeah, I also noticed on some of the other monitors. Um, I didn't download the data, but I do have Teton Pass and Flag Ranch, Wyoming. Yeah, it was coming in thick during that time. Let me go back to the proper time. All right, there we go. Teton Pass. And then up here at the top is Maple Creek. And see that? Yeah, more likely we had the magma coming up through the uh, neck of the plume. Remember, it comes all the way up from the Gulf of California. The plume is about 250 miles wide. And then it comes up um, there at Yellowstone. So that's what it was showing during that time. So this is West Thumb. All right, we'll pull it over a little bit. See the line of melt? All right, and let's go to Maple Creek. That's what it was showing on this monitor. And yeah, we got two earthquakes here. Let's go to this one. 2142 Universal Time. Not being reported. The last earthquake I just showed you, too, that one is not being reported also. This one, too, did rattle for a bit. And it came in, let's go down here, as a magnitude 1.67. Yeah, this was not at the Snake River, or, um, yeah, because there's no P wave on it. Okay, let's extract that. All right, once again, volcanic tremors, magnitude 1.62. Okay, the next one on here at 306 Universal. Oh, my mistake. They did report that last one as a magnitude 1.5. Okay, 306, they're reporting a 1.8. And that's what I got, a 1.88. Look at the gases that came up and the heat. Look how it just kind of like flames going towards the right. Yeah, yeah, hot water and gases. And it comes in as a 1.88. So they did report that one. And this one here. I was mistaken. Yeah, they did report that one. All right, what else we got? This is all for Maple Creek. We got a small one at uh, 1407. Not being reported. I wanted to show you. Yeah, sometimes I make mistakes. This one comes in as a magnitude 1.15. Let's see. The next one marked in red would be this one right here at 1513. Yeah, look at them pockets of melt right there. I shortened up the seismic signature, but you can see it rattled for a little bit. And that one comes in as a magnitude 1.33. Could have made it longer. Did I do this one? Um, 1619 today. Yeah, I believe I showed you that on the other one. Um, not being reported. And I believe I showed you this one too at 2216. Was that reported? Let's check. Yeah, I'm starting to laugh here. They're saying that one was a 0 0.4. That one, too, is a volcanic tremors. I'm I'm assuming that majority of oh, it went small. Majority of these probably are. Let's see. Yep, volcanic tremors. And I believe I already showed you that one. Yep. See, rounded tops. Okay. Let's check out something else. Now, this is Holmes Hill, which is close to Hedgen Lake. Okay, there's the monitor. Right there. Can I make it bigger? And this is Hedgen Lake. This is what it was showing when I pulled the files. Oh, probably almost an hour ago. You can see we got three lines of melt. Very faint. Pockets of melt. Okay. Oh, yeah, we got more heat that came up. There's that other earthquake I was talking about. And then over here we got some... Let's look at the seismic signature for right there. Yeah. Fault line movement. Okay. And lots of little popping going on right there. Yep. Yeah. They're a little bit more distinct there. And there, we'll just kind of jump around. Yeah, okay. 
There's that other earthquake. Let's bring this up. Okay. There's those other two earthquakes. Let's see what was showing when I first pulled the files. Let's take a look at the seismic signature. Yeah. Yeah, fault movement. Yeah. Okay. We got a little tiny one here. Yep. More of the same, right? Are you prepared? I'm just trying to move this over and I end up moving the uh, line where the earthquakes are at with the spectrogram. All right, then we got this. Some more um, long duration, slow moving earthquake. Yeah. All right, yeah. Very cool. You can see here all the small microquakes, lots of them. Let me close that. I guess I should start at the top and just come down and click on them. Be easier to follow through. Yeah. Oh, lion's going off. Oh, it just stopped. There it goes. Stops and goes. Must be a lot of people using up the bandwidth. Yeah, lion. That's been really active lately. Highly active. Let me pull this over. There's some dead trees over here you can see. Yeah. I don't really see any people over here close by to watch the show. Yeah. Well, it's currently 6... 16 no 619 central daylight time so it'd be 519 there at the park looks like there might be one man way back over here could be a little head i see sticking up yeah so what are your thoughts yep short and about the same yep doesn't look as dirty as what it did earlier when i posted the picture on twitter yeah but you can see over here as the water dissipates yeah yeah very pretty nice color today um they got the focus worked out pretty good for a change oh there's another man coming over here taking a picture say cheese <laughs> anyways you got any questions or thoughts put it down below thank you very much for watching thank you for sharing my videos and thank you for subscribing Please stay safe, and I will talk to you later. God bless you. Bye.